quick too. <laughs> you know why I come quick? Cause I fucking love pussy, dude. You know? <laughs> all these guys who last all nights because they're dicks and they're like, I wish this was a butt. <laughs> because I want to get back to talking about your day, ladies. <laughs> it's fucking feminism, dude. It's fucking feminism. I was called gay so much in high school, at some point I was like, maybe they're right. Maybe, maybe they know me better than I know me, you know? Even, it sticks with you, too. Even when I go down on a woman, now I'm like, <laughs> Trevor said this wasn't for me. <laughs> want a guy who was called a fag a lot in high school. <laughs> I actually want to write that down. That's incredibly funny. That's I never so said funny. that word on stage. Everyone should get one divorce. <laughs> Don't you think? The ugly people stay together. Hot people get divorced, right? Won't say that again. Uh, <laughs> Four stay together, okay? <laughs> if you've been together for 50 years, I bet you got something on your face. I bet. <laughs> I guarantee the old people laughing at each other. <laughs> he does have a curved dick. He's not going anywhere. I got the only pussy that fits in this county. Uh, <laughs> They're old. That was funny if you're smart. Uh, my comedy is for smart elves who fuck. So if you, don't, if you don't like it at any point, sorry, you little beta cuck loser. That's not my, that's not my fucking fault. What do you do for a living? What do you do? I'm an artist. You're an artist. Yes. What type of what type of art you do? Painting. Painting. Yeah. What's your abstract impressionism? Both. Both. <laughs> I don't know enough about either word to know if that makes sense. <laughs> said two words and you kind of you kind of called my bluff <laughs> kind of called my bluff I don't really do those Venn diagrams overlap does anyone know what impressionism means does anyone besides her know do you know you look like you would know no is, I know what does it mean let's learn in 1870s <laughs> you're about to go on a little tirade <laughs> I like to learn. <laughs> That's the worst thing I've ever said on stage. That's truly the most offensive. I, I like to learn. Uh, but no, ma'am, I'll give you 15 seconds to explain. Well, historic, historically, the Impressionists were different from the, any other kind of painting at the time. So they would, go, they would go outdoors and do different types of work, whereas uh, they would... <laughs> it's so funny how all these men are heckling you. <laughs> these guys who haven't read a book in 30 years are like, oh, my brain's full with football replays right now. Uh, if I learn Impressionism, I forget who won the Super Bowl in 2003. Uh, <laughs> I don't really understand what you were saying, but I'm going to Google it later, man. Thank you, man. That's awesome. You must be kind of good. No. No? <laughs> People are just stupid. Yeah. Or, you, or is your husband rich? <laughs> He's got a curved dick. He's not rich. Uh, are you an artist too, man? No. Do you tell her she's a good painter? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> what did you do? What did you retire from? Engineering. Engineering. Oh, my dad was an engineer. I kind of don't like you now. Uh, <laughs> You seem to like me more than he did, though. You're laughing, at least. I like that. My dad was always kind of hit or miss. Sometimes he hit me, sometimes he missed me. Y'all having a good fucking Lent? <laughs> Where are my fucking Lent friends?
freaks out. Where are we at? Who is, is this a Catholic or Lutheran area of the country? Stop playing. Not What'd you say? Stop playing. Stop playing? <laughs> You're white, dude. That was weird. <laughs> what? Thank you, man. Is it Lutheran? Uh, neither. Neither? I think it's... Abortion's not legal. It's something. Uh, <laughs> the atheists aren't like, life begins when God doesn't exist? Uh, <laughs> That was a great riff. That deserved more. Right? Yeah, like, it has to be something. What is it? Catholic or Lutheran? Is it Catholic? Catholic. Catholic. Yeah, it's because of one true faith. I love to hear that. Oh, that's <laughs> do you know what Lent did? Do you have to? Do you were raised Catholic then? Mm-hmm. Did you have to give up something for Lent when you were a kid? Yeah. You know, if you guys don't know, during Lent, if you're Catholic, if you were raised the right way, you have to. Uh, <laughs> you have to give up something for 40 days because Jesus. No one knows why. Uh, I would always try to be funny in high school. I'd be like, "Yeah, Jesus died for my sins, so I'm giving up orgies." You know? <laughs> That's gonna be tough because I'm a big fucker. <laughs> don't know how I'm not gonna slip into some clam for 40 days. But. Anything for you, J Dog, yeah. Nobody believes that. Nobody believes that Jesus died for their sins. No, they never slipped in it. Yeah. Oh. 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 Oh.
same in your black dog life. <laughs> Let's do the sex. <laughs> You're a scientist? That's so vague. <laughs> what do you do? I'm a chemist at a pharmaceutical com company. Boom! <laughs> <laughs> which, which big pharma do you work for? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> the one that gave me myocarditis? <laughs> I went to bed till I was 17. Whatever. Who gives a shit? It's cool as hell. Uh, this is a thing. Do you guys know that adult bedwetting is one of three physical characteristics shared by every single serial killer? <laughs> yeah. Thank God I'm not also white and skinny. <laughs> if you laugh, you're safe. If you laugh, you're safe.